I have something for you. Meet me now. Hey, it's Raymond. Raymond Ho. Been a while since we've seen him. Wonder what he's up to nowadays. I read your report. I'm flattered. Is it a slow day or something? Pendrew's very impressed. I'm not gonna lie, I'm sort of impressed too. He wants you to dig around, see what you can find on Sunny Woe. Says it's a priority. I read about it. I mean, he reps entertainers, dabbles in porn, with allegedly some human trafficking mixed in. Well, why go after him? He's not Sun On Yi. To bring down the Sun On Yi, we have to take down the people who support them, cut off the revenue sources, dismantle the network. This is how we hit him where it hurts. Sunny's revenue stream is massive, and a lot of it flows to Sun On Yi. I see what I can do, Raymond. By the way, you hear anything about Dog Eyes? He seems to have disappeared. Haven't heard a thing. He's kind of been oh, made into forget, stew. Jackie Ma, we're taking him in. Jackie? From what I read in your reports, he'll be a good source of info, and it won't be hard to make him talk. We'll need you to set him up no, for no, us. No, that, that makes no sense. He's nobody. He's a criminal, way. You're a cop. I hate to be a broken record, but it sounds like you're getting attached. I'm not getting attached. I'm just... I'm not a fucking idiot, okay? I think I prefer Pendrew over this guy. He brought me in. He's the one who vouched for me. And now you're so high up, you don't need him. He's outlived his usefulness, so we're bringing him in. I'm taking this up for Pendrew. This came from Pendrew. Taking him in accomplishes nothing, and it makes my job harder. I'm not doing it. You don't have a choice, all right? It's a direct order. Yeah? Direct order? Well, that's an order you can shove directly up your ass, Raymond. Yeah, we're only getting slightly attached to the sun on ye. Only slightly. Maybe a little bit. So, uh, yeah, we're just going to kind of blatantly ignore cop orders. Now, is this my uh, houseboat apartment? Because this looks pretty neat. We want the red ones, the lieutenants like Winston. Open your eyes, Raymond. I am Winston. That's what worries me, Way. You're one of them. I like how that like wristband doesn't go all the way around my wrist. That makes very little sense. But anyway, hey, new place. Cool. Let's have a check. Let's check this out. What books have we got? Hong Kong. Hong Kong. Hong Kong. It's all about Hong Kong. What's that other one? Bedside something. All right. It is the tenth of something, and we got ourselves a new toilet. So awesome. We got ourselves an Aberdeen houseboat. So now we've got a home in North Point, a home in Central, and a home in Aberdeen. I'm wondering if we're going to get a home in Kennedy Town before this game's over. Wouldn't surprise me. Very much wouldn't surprise me. Hey, I got myself a like, punch bag, and I can't even punch while I'm inside the house, so that's pointless. This is a very big, luxurious boat. Look, you've got a dartboard and everything. It's a very luxurious boat. Look at this. What's on the table? Newspaper? All right. Very flat newspaper. Like, it pretty much... Yeah, it's a very, very flat newspaper. You can't really see it if you tilt your camera that way. And is that everything we've got in our new house? What's this over here? Is this a phone? What is it? Oh, it's a baseball cap for some reason. Alright, I'm not complaining. So, whereabouts is our houseboat? Is it on the uh, docks? Ah, it's on Aberdeen Island. It's actually on like a separate island from the mainland, which is kind of interesting. We should probably have like a quick like drive around the island once, just to see if there's any like health shrines or anything. Yep, I realise I just keep going on about health shrines, but you know what? They are kind of... Uh, something that I do genuinely want to find because pretty much need a health upgrade at this point. How many do I need for another health upgrade? Uh, I need to press the start button and go down to upgrades. How many do I have? I need another three for health upgrade. I don't think we're going to find another three on this island, but you know, we might find like maybe two. I think there'll probably be one at the docks. And there might be another on like the other side of the island or something. Is there a uh, health shrine anywhere around here? This is the kind of place where there should be a health shrine. There really should. There's a lockbox up there. There is a lockbox up there. I'm getting that lockbox. How do I get up there? Are we going to have to do some ridiculous, awesome parkour? Just going to have a look around here for a health shrine. Nothing around here. But there is definitely, 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 definitely a lockbox on this ship over here. Yeah, I'm guessing we can like just climb up to it like this. And then climb up here. And then there we go. Easiness. I'm going to look around, but I can't actually see any uh, thing. Uh, I should do this. So the first number is 12. Then the next number is... 
23. Then the next number is 5. It's always freaking 5. There's always a 5 in it. I don't... Oh, no, it's 6. Okay. It's not a 5. It lied to me. Everything else I can see from up here, just... See, this is a nice little vantage point. Let's have a little look around. Doesn't look to be anything that I can see immediately. Maybe if I look, like, out over there. Like, across the shore. Nope. Can't see anything from where I am. I don't know if there's, like, a range at which the uh, health shrines will become visible or not. But... Basically, from where I am, I cannot see any health shrines. Is there a way out of this water? Can I just climb out anywhere? Nope, of course not. That'd be way too easy. How do I get out of here? Must be like a ramp somewhere. But where is a very good question. I really have no idea. Hey, guys, can you tell me how I get out of here? Because my clothes are getting a little bit wet. In fact, my clothes are already very wet. I'm pretty sure I've been, like, fully submerged at this point. Yep. I don't know how to get out of this current predicament that I have found myself in. That's pretty... great. <laughs> Not really, how do I get out? I can't appear to get out in the slightest. I'm gonna have to, like, swim all the way around the docks. Oh, I can, like, sprint swim. That's okay. That's good. I can, like, go on a little, uh, super fast swim. Let us do this. Let us swim as fast as we can. As if our life depended on it, because it probably does. Can we get out on these rocks or something? Oh, nope. That ain't happening. So I've actually got to find a ramp of some kind. Like where the boats are getting on and off. This sounds like it would be an easy prospect as a dock, but honestly, it is not. <laughs> it's like around there. I can't even see it at all. In fact, there is a one. Am I stuck forever? Wait, what's this? Can I get out here? Yes. I think this is like right next to where I jumped in, but pff, whatever. <laughs> I'm pretty uh, observant when it comes to things like this. As y'all should well be aware by now. So, we have a parking thing over here. I'm just you know, getting used to my new home and getting used to the area around my new home. It's a pretty cool place, this place. We're on like an island thing. It's pretty cool. Give me my motorbike. I need my motorbike. Because this motorbike is going to help me get around the island. Yeah, I want to take, like, take at least one trip around the island just to see if there's anything, you know, around in plain sight. Oh, hello. Hello there. I'm not exactly in plain sight, but, you know, I found it anyway, so whatever. Did I see something else over there? No, I did not. Health Shrine. Hopefully we'll find, like, one more on this island. I don't think we'll find, like, two more. There might be two more, but I don't think we'll find two more, because chances are at least one of them will probably be, you know, well enough hidden that I won't be able to uh, find it. However, oh, turn, 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 ah, before the stairs, <laughs> final reverse. But I imagine that we might be able to pick up another one or so, if we just keep our eyes peeled and have a little look around. I'm more interested in health shrines than lockboxes, I've got to say. If I see a lockbox, I'm just like, eh. <laughs> More money. Great. Love that. Is there anything up there? Ah, let's check out up here. Might be something up here. There might be something up here. There isn't anything up here from the looks of things. Oh well. We've gone like a quarter of the way around the island already. <laughs> it is a small place. I don't think I've ever actually been on this island before at all for any mission ever. So that's pretty cool. Getting to see the uh, local environment. Have we been on this island before? I don't know. We might have been at some point. Oh, health shrine, health shrine! Healthy shrine! Another healthy shrine. I'm turning round. I'm turning round. You can't stop me. Might even get a full health upgrade. That would be crazy. That would just be the most crazy thing ever. Oh my god. Health shrine. Just need one more. I'm a bit dubious as to whether we'll actually find it again, because... Although, how, long, how far have we gone around the island? Like, we're not even halfway yet. And we've already found two. This, this bodes well. This, this bodes well. This is, this is pleasing me. I am pleased right now. So we'll get ourselves a health upgrade. Because <coughs> I only need one more. That is all we need. Hello there, police officer. I, I hope you're doing well today. I'm just going to speed past you at, like, the speed of sound. Or something. Anything over here? Nope. <coughs> 
Anything over here? Nope. Anything over here? Uh, going a little bit slow because, you know, we're, we're in a slightly more dense populated area. So I've got to kind of be slow and just kind of look around both sides of the road. Looking left, looking right, not seeing anything. Yeah, I don't think we're going to find another health shrine on our way around. I'd be very surprised if we did at least. Because, you know, they've put like two in plain view. I don't think the third one will be. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've been all around the island. Yeah, we have. So, where are we actually going now? We don't have a tribe mission to do. So we're going to have to actually go back to Central Hospital, which is a long way away. Oh jeez, I'm going to have to find a taxi. There's a taxi, but I want to do a quick drive over this bridge. Because there may be a health shrine on the left or right of this bridge, you know. This seems like a good place for a health shrine to be. But there are none at all, so... That's where I'd have put a health shrine if I were making this game. I guess that's why I don't make this game. Because I'd put health shrines in stupid places. Now I need to find a taxi. I realised I'd just pretty much found a taxi and I just drove away from it for no reason, but... Hey. <laughs> pretty good at planning ahead. Uh, now, now I want a taxi, there's freaking motorbikes everywhere. As soon as I want a motorbike, there's freaking taxis everywhere and nothing anywhere. As soon as I'm on a mission, there's taxis everywhere, that I should say. Because taxis, you can't actually use taxis if you're on a mission. That is kind of their little downside. Uh, is that a taxi? No. No, that is a normal car. Oh, taxi? Anywhere? Because like, I've got to get all the way to like the other side of the entire freaking map. And, well, actually, let's go over here while we do it. Let's do Pied Piper Redux. I don't remember what mission Pied Piper was, but apparently we're doing a redux of it. That's pretty cool. Where is it? Over here. Oh god, I'm dead. Yeah, chances are this mission would probably have told me to uh, get rid of my motorcycle anyway, so I don't really care. Hey, Conroy. How are you? I'm it's freaking Winston. We gotta do this. All right. What is it we gotta do? Get a load of this. One of Dog Ice's crew trying to sell fucking catamaran on our turf. I figured it'll be perfect if the cops showed up. Save us some trouble of killing him. You know what I mean? Okay. Get some cops on your tail. Oh boy. Hi there. Sup? <laughs> uh, sorry, but I need to go get this guy. <laughs> that was fun. Get some cops on your tail. S quietly walk over and then boop. In the face. Right in the face. Right in. Power right in the kisser. Come on. Look! Over there! There's a guy selling ketamine! That's just craziness. I'm going to run like hell towards the guy that's selling ketamine in the hopes that the police will stop chasing me. This seems like a perfect plan that will always work. He just ran right past me! <laughs> okay, wow, all the police just like stop chasing me, they're just like, oh my god, that guy over there has ketamine! Quick, get him! He must be killed! And there we go, we got some face, we got some experience, what is this? What is this? Herbal like tea? Sounds good. Sure. Thank you, sir. I have $433,000. I'm probably going to end this game with like, close to a million, if not actually a million. Very probably. <laughs> like, I don't even have the DLC that gives you like, extra lockboxes everywhere that have more money in. And it's just like, yeah. <laughs> uh, whatever. <clears throat> so, I need to find a taxi. This does not change the fact that I need to find a taxi. I really need to find a taxi. This does not change that fact. Because the mission is still a very long way away. Is there anything like behind me? Is there a taxi coming up behind me? No, you're a motorbike. Motorbike, actually, you know what, you'll do. Let's go find a taxi. Whoa, it's a fast motorbike. I like this motorbike, but the problem is, chances are, uh, a mission would actually make me give up the motorbike anyway, because it always freaking does. So, whatever. Really, I'm on the highway. I don't think you can find taxis on the highway. But whatever, we might as well at least move in the right direction. I'm... I really don't want to drive all the way there because it's a really long freaking way away. It's like a thousand meters, like, by bird. By bird? Is that the right expression? Something like that. 
as the crow flies, as they say. So by, uh, so by road, it'll probably be a lot longer, considering these paths are very windy. But like I say, I don't think you can actually find uh, taxis on the highway. So actually, it does look like I'm going to be driving all the way there because I'm apparently too lazy to get off the highway and go find myself a taxi. Because, you know, I, I searched for a taxi for like, what, a couple of minutes? Didn't find one. As far as, that, as far as I know, there are no taxis in this town anymore. They've all given up and gone home. So uh, that, is, that is a very real possibility. And because that is a very real possibility, I feel quite justified in uh, just kind of crashing into this car over here. And also kind of just driving around for myself. Actually, are there any taxis? Any taxis? I really need a taxi. There's like none anywhere. What the hell's going on? Oh, I need to go this way. I need to go this way. Whoa. whoa. Surprised I actually managed that without some kind of fatal crash there. It is raining. It is raining. That is not good. Rain is not particularly good. Hello there. Hope you don't mind me crashing into you. Just a little thing I do nowadays. Ah, uh, jeez. This is like the longest drive so far in this game. Hey, I remember this place. This is the place where uh, there was a, some kind of fatal crash. I think. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not like. I don't have that good of a memory. Pretty sure that was the place where uh, Ace got thrown off a cliff, though. That was funny. I enjoyed that. Oh. Thanks. Thanks, thanks, driver, for just randomly stopping in front of me. And we're here. Faster than, probably faster than to finding a taxi, actually. Oh, look at that. I've got the longest bank jump ever. Come on, park on the mission thing. There we go. What do you want me to do? Get a disguise. Get a disguise? 